Compressing IP version 6 addresses. So, IP version 6 addresses are quite long. As you can see here, they are made up of eight segments, with each segment separated by a colon, and inside of each segment are four hexadecimal digits. And each hexadecimal digit could be between 0 and 9, or between A and F, because it's hexadecimal. So they're long, which makes them quite difficult to work with. Uh, they're quite hard to read, quite hard to write, uh, and they're pretty much next to impossible to remember. So we need a way for us humans to be able to compress those addresses where possible, so that it makes it easier for us humans to handle. And that's where the IP version 6 compression comes in. So there's a number of different things that we can do. And the first thing that we can do is we can remove any leading zeros inside of a segment. So here we've got a leading zero there in 0 FD2. So we can just put use that as FD2. In there we've got three leading zeros. So we can just replace that with a 1. Two leading zeros, replace that with eight, nine, etc., etc., and you could do that with all of the leading zeros, uh, but you cannot do it with any trailing zeros here. And the reason being is that removing leading zeros doesn't change the value of the actual number. So zero, 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 zero is the same as zero because uh, it's just zero. And okay, same here, just like. 0001 is the same as 1. It works the same in hexadecimal, as binary, as normal deanery numbers. So we can't uh, get rid of the trailing zeros because 4500 zero, zero, is not the same as 45. So, but we could do it to most of it. And as you can see there, the shortened version of the URL at the uh, shortened version of the IP address there at the bottom is a, quite a bit shorter than the original. But there's some more clever tricks that we can do as well. So let's have a look. So the next thing we can do is we can remove uh, entire segments of inline zeros. So if you look at this web, this uh, IP address here, you can see is you've got one, two, three, four, zero FD two, and then you've got one, two, three, four, five whole segments where there's nothing really in there of any interest. So what we can do is we can completely get rid of those segments. And the way it works is, first of all, we just shorten down the original here. So 0FD2, that just goes down to FD2. 0045 can be shortened down to 45. And this entire run here of zeros can just be replaced with a double colon, a colon at the start here and a colon at the finish here. So the whole thing shortens down to 1, 2, 3, 4, FD2, double colon, and then 4, 5, which is much, much easier to read, almost comparable to a IP version 4 address. So let's have a look. Let's do a few examples. Um, now, a few examples here. This It's important to note that this can be done anywhere within the address. So for instance, here, it can be done where there are empty zero segments here at the start of the address. So you just get rid of all the zeros and put a double colon at the start to indicate that the, the beginning is all zeros. Uh, we can do it here in the middle. So just like in the previous example, pop down the numbers that we need and then do your double colon right through and then have the last bit there. And it can also work at the end. So if there's nothing at the end here, if that's all zeros, then just put your star and a double colon there. So it really does shorten these IP addresses down significantly. Uh, there's a few points to note, though, and that is you can only use a double colon once in a run. Uh, and so if we look here, we've got FD23, then we've got a, uh, a run of two segments of zeros followed by a number followed by sorry by a non-empty one followed by a run of zeros here you can't do two lots of colons and the reason being is that when you come to decompress it you have no idea where these zeros go you know there's going to be some zeros here and you know there's going to be some zeros here but is it one segment here and then four segments there is it four segments here and one segment there, 
two and three, three and two, etc. You don't know, so we can't do that. Um, what we can do, of course, is we can look and go, okay, well, this is the longest run of zeros, this three segment, so this end bit here will replace those with just a double colon, and you can, of course, here on the final step is replace these zeros. You can't get rid of them completely, but you can compress them like we did in the original step, and you can just replace them with a single zero. So that long address there gets com uh, compressed all the way down. There you go. So that is how you compress IP version 6 addresses. Thank you very much.